Some workers who are supposed to watch out for planes at Austin's airport are flying blind. According to documents from the National Transportation Safety Board, weather observers at the airport are working in a windowless room without internet access. KVU Sports Sanders looked into the NTSB report to learn more. Close calls, staffing shortages. Those are some of the headlines we've seen surrounding Austin's airport in recent months. Now, NTSB documents say weather observers on site who monitor conditions on the tarmac are not getting the resources they need. A report tied to the near collision between two planes on a foggy morning in February 2023 mentions that at the time of that incident, FAA contracted weather observers at the air traffic control tower were in a windowless office. I certainly think it's a safety related issue. I, I will stand by that. Troy Kimmel is a meteorologist and senior lecturer for UT Austin's Department of Geography and Environment. He says from his understanding, several years ago, these observers moved into the observation tower. At that point, there was just not any room available. They were stuck uh, in a second story closet, basically, with no windows, and uh, that's where they continue to be. The tower you see right behind me does have windows, and it always has at least one person up there, but it's not the weather observers. According to this NTSB investigation report, as far as the weather observers are concerned, they're on the second floor with no windows, no internet, and no phones allowed at all in that tower. If they actually want to get the weather, they're going to have to step outside the building altogether just to do their job. The weather observers do need to have access to the outside. They also need internet access to see satellite radar data. Just keep in mind, these are weather observers in the tower out at Bergstrom that can't even look at weather radar. Kimmel says this is really only the case at Austin's airport. In a statement to KVU, an FAA spokesperson wrote in part, quote, contract weather observers provide crucial weather information at air traffic control facilities. There have been no issues with CWOs obtaining weather observations at Austin Tower. Electronic devices, including cell phones, are not permitted in control towers. The airport uses information from systems called ASOS, Automated Surface Observing Systems. However, Kimmel says these can only do so much and need human backup. Our ASOS in Austin at Austin Bergstrom International Airport cannot even on its own, unlike most ASOSs across the country, cannot sense freezing rain. Kimmel saying he has a lot of respect for the FAA's employees and hopes to see them get the resources they need. In Austin, Ford Sanders, KVU News.